Hey Colossians community, it's Arden from Colossians School here and today we're gonna talk about basics and difference between the basic exercises and calisthenic moves. For everyone, for every athlete, basics and moves is just totally different things. But today I will show you and we will discuss some moves which are kind of basic moves or basic tricks of calisthenics. So let's get started. So, in the one hand, we have basics. Basics is when you need to work on your body complex, comprehensively working on all joints of the chain, right? And on the other hand is move. It's when you dedicate it for some unique or really specialized goal. So, they are totally different, as you can see, but sometimes you can combine them and get basic calisthenic moves which you can use for comprehensive improvement of your body and today we're going to talk about that and the first one is muscle up of course it is not a secret muscle up improving your pulling power your pushing power your core power everything in the same time and that's why it's number one for comprehensive improvement or development of your body and that's why is number one in our list of basic moves so second one push-ups but not really like this like this Yes, it is handstand push-ups, pretty hard exercise and pretty hard move, I know, but you can't even imagine how good is that for your body. It's not only for pushing power, it also improves your upper back complex weight and also your core stabilizers and also all the stabilizers of your body and feeling of balance. So pretty comprehensive exercise pretty comprehensive move and that's why it's top two in our list of basic calisthenics moves or tricks or whatever <laughs> and the last one of our golden three is human flag but why always me showing you those exercises let my personal student show it to you he is doing it much better than me Yes, human flag, don't be surprised because this is the best exercise for core improvement. And to be honest, we all have luck of our core, especially our size, because in calisthenics tricks, we don't really improve that a lot. And this one, flag, is just goal to improve these muscles. But also you improving your pushing and pulling power because you need to pull a lot statically with your top arm and push a lot with your pushing bottom arm and that's why it's complex and that's why it's top three in our golden three basic calisthenic moves and we have last two questions the first one is how to learn all those moves because they are pretty nice for comprehensive work on your body and they are looking so nice and the second one how can you use them all together and in both questions i have an answer in my advanced course there you will understand from the scratch how to learn any advanced calisthenic moves such as muscle up such as handstand push-ups and as well l seat v seat human flag dragon flag and so many things out there and when you will learn them you will understand how to combine them all of them on any level of preparation in comprehensive program of training so check it out all the links in the description
By the way, guys, what do you think about all these exercises? Which one is your preference? Which one is your top one? Let me know in comments and see you in the next video. Subscribe to the channel, don't forget to thumbs up and don't forget to turn on notification button to see our videos first. See you.